Dictionary world did I ever or maybe it was um misinterpreted that I'm saying that I came up with the word nasty no it's this I feel like y'all know how I be like nasty um, one thing about me I've been like this anybody who know me for real some people that, like stand on what you say baby don't hide behind the bushes cause one thing about every elbow I say what I gotta say from my page from my face <laughs> From my phone, from my camera, whatever, I say what I gotta say. From me, I don't hide behind no bushes or no fake pages. I'm like, that smells good. How do y'all smell it? Does she look like me? No. No. E-gain, y'all know I have gained 14 pounds. It's no secret. And baby, I said I gotta do something about this. So I decided to try Colin Broom Premium. Y'all already know I love Colin Broom. But now they have a premium edition which is targeted for weight loss. And baby, skin scan this QR code. Y'all can read all about it. Cause y'all know I was like, please put me on. Y'all, it's the same, same exact way as I use my other Colin Broom. You do one scoop and 12 to um 14 ounces of water. And baby let me just tell y'all about it so it turns fat into fuel and baby i got a lot of fat so i have a lot of fuel now um it reduces cravings which is a main main problem for me i'm always hungry and i don't know why um it reduces gut issues which is also another problem for me it improves it improves your overall well-being with vitamin b6 which um can reduce this like your tiredness and i'm always tired y'all i drink it every day before a meal about 30 minutes before a meal and i love it it has a good taste it's like a strawberry flavor y'all trust me let's do this together colon broom you need it let's get into the vlog
stay here I want every little bit I ain't never seen a drip like this Heaven at my fingertips Let's not let a minute slip to Say you Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, baby, because you are going to like it. And welcome back to my OGs. Today is Monday morning. Um, Yeah, I'm getting my day started. I just had my tea. I'm about to log in for work. Tonight, we're going out to eat. Y'all will see when we get there. But we're going to get dressed up and get real crew, real crew, real crew. And I'm going to wear that. Um. That dress that I got from Rainbow that I didn't show y'all last vlog, how to style it, it was $13.99. So yeah, I'm gonna wear that $13.99 dress. It look like a million bucks. So yeah, I'm just about to log in, um, do my work for today. I do have to work today. When I get off, we'll do hair, makeup, and head on out to eat. We're gonna have a nice, a nice time. We're going to, um, it's a little classy. So yeah, I'm ready for the vibes. Ready to go enjoy myself. Okay, y'all, it is hours later. I'm off work. I'm about to. So the kids have food from yesterday, boo grill. So they got a bunch of stuff left. So they can eat that. Y'all know I try to make sure the house straight before I leave. Because I'm going out with a friend. Not out, but to dinner. I'm so excited about this restaurant. It's new. It's kind of new. I mean, it's been here a little few weeks now. A couple months, you know. I don't know. It might even be more than a couple months. But it's new. I haven't been yet. So I'm so excited about going. So I'm about to go ahead and bathe Cameron, get him all dressed, ready for bed. Cause um he gotta go, he not on spray break, he gotta go to school tomorrow. So yeah, let me go ahead and get him ready. $13.99 and I'm going to pair it with these red little shoes I already have. I feel these are so cute. I've had them so long. They're so freaking cute to me. And then I am, um, this is a necklace that I got from Rainbow as well. It's just like a herringbone. And this was $5.99. So this, and then I'm going to wear this gold uh bag yeah because we can like we want to get kind of dressed up it's a nice little 
we just wanted to get cute anyway but i just want to come in and tell y'all that um it's six o'clock so i'm trying to be on time i want to be out of the house in the next 20 minutes so i can be on time y'all i just had to come right back we can't open it now but when i had bought some stuff from nordstrom the other day they told me i qualify for a free gift baby there's a lot of stuff baby we're gonna go through it tomorrow but or tonight but i see tom ford um bitter peach i see uh revolution carolina good girl girl is so much stuff in here kylie skin oh my gosh tori birch girl girl they sent me a bag full of stuff. Anyway, let's get going. Wigs, so we're going to be loading many of those on the website. Um, but wig. I tried to make some makeshift baby hair. Polite, heartfelt email explaining to them that, you know, the wig is showing that this is not a request for another wig. Because guys, you know, this black on black on black on black, a woman. Oh my God, Lee, like, this is something, guys, that I had been meaning to talk to tell y'all. Meet them a rich man. You can move to Houston and really meet you a rich woman. Because all... Okay, y'all, I'm dressed and ready. Ooh. Okay, y'all, I'm dressed and ready. Got on my dress. I'm about to put on these cute little shoes. Hair, makeup done. I got to get out the door. Y'all, I wanted to try this, um... Get stuff off my hands real quick. I wanted to try this um, Tom Ford Bitter Peach that I saw in this bag because I don't have Bitter Peach. So, so y'all know what y'all doing. Nordstrom, y'all know what y'all doing because y'all know I'm going to come back and buy it. So, let's see. Hold on. Mmm. That smells good, y'all. Tom Ford Bitter Peach. Mmm. Now, I can smell like a peach. I ain't want to smell like no Girl Scout cookie. But I smell like a peach now. Nah, it smell good. Okay, I'll probably try to get Lisa to take a full body picture. I got to go, y'all. See y'all in the car. Y'all, I'm so mad. I was so excited to go to Gemma. Y'all, why is I'm driving? You know how GPS would be like, your destination will be closed within an hour. GPS tells me as I'm driving, your destination is closed today. Say what? Say what? I was so excited we all dressed up Nisi dressed up too I haven't seen her yet but she's dressed up too she was already on her way like Nisi was like she, oh my god here we go I need to put my mouth up and why Cam got that that um Burger King in my back seat that he had yesterday anyway y'all I don't be noticing my back seat till I get on camera with y'all but yeah y'all I'm looking all cute if I do say so myself all dressed up looking nice and it's closed I wanted to go to Gemma so bad. I'm really about sick of this camera. But anyway, yeah, y'all. So I think we just gonna go to Roof Chris. Y'all know I've been wanting to go to Roof Chris anyway. I've been craving some of their stuffed chicken. So we're just gonna go to Roof Chris. And I'll try to get a full body picture so that y'all can see this $13 dress with the shoes in the purse. But yeah, y'all, I'm 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 definitely mad. I'm 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 so mad, y'all. I'm so so mad. I was all cute and stuff. But yeah, Roof Chris is a vibe too. And long as we're like together and we get to talk and stuff. So yeah, I'll see y'all when we get there. Me, Paul Chelsea. I am on the way home. Y'all be listening to YouTube videos on y'all way home, cause I do. Anyway, y'all, it is like it's almost a few minutes to eleven. I'm just leaving 
um roof chris with nisi we had a good time baby we was just sitting there talking we had a good 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 time it's only 2024 is the year of positivity and happiness and we just we're accomplishing we we're accomplishing all of our goals we're being happy where everybody youtube channel is growing I, I just wish everybody the best for their channels whatever you aspire to do in life even if it's not youtube i just want everybody to accomplish their goals this year and yeah so anyway i'm on the way home i got boo food y'all how the heck like i ended up paying 250 dollars like how y'all slide and i need to put that car mount on 250 dollars baby i told me i should have stayed home no i'm just playing but um our next day is going to be we were just we were talking a lot about fitness and um y'all know i done told y'all okay if y'all slide again we just gonna talk tomorrow um i i told y'all before that like um Nisi um did like really good on like her weight loss so we were talking about fitness like getting fit so she went not only did she calm me down and you know get me to like ignore negativity but we like she got me back hype and focused on my weight loss journey so I'm so excited even though I've been implementing little stuff already I just want to go like she got me amped up to go full throttle baby and if you ain't got a friend that amp you up baby you need one because yeah she got me ready so even though it's late, it's early for me to go to bed. I already got cam clothes pulled out for tomorrow. I'm gonna pull my workout clothes out tomorrow. I already got my headphones charged. And we're gonna work out in the morning. And yeah, cause like y'all, I really do notice like when I gain weight, I be feeling like, ugh. Like I be fat, tired, and lazy. And it is so true. Like even though like people might not wanna admit it, baby, when you be heavier, you be tired, like I be tired when I be heavier. I be lazy and tired. I don't want to do anything. And I feel so sluggish and I like all that bad stuff I be eating, all those toxins be in my body. And it be a mess. And this is the this is the year of none of that. So I'm excited, y'all. I really want y'all to join this weight loss journey with me. The um the Colin Broom Premium, like y'all, it really does work. Like it really does. Like if you really stick to it, it really does work, y'all. Um, not just say like I don't make money off of y'all clicking the link and buying it. Yeah, it was a sponsorship, but I don't make money from y'all like clicking the link. So if I'm telling y'all it works, it really like for me it's working. So I'm excited, y'all. Let's do this together. Y'all help me to stay like on this positive journey and yeah so i'm headed home i don't know if i'm gonna pick y'all up tonight because i need to be like doing my skincare and getting to bed so that we can get up early and yeah so i'll talk to y'all tomorrow that's good. and this is really good for the girlies who what's up you gang girl it is Tuesday. I was listening to y'all. I just found this YouTuber recently. Her name is Rochelle Chanel. I'm going to put a picture of her page on um, the screen and I'm going to link it below. Babe, when I tell you I love this lady, she's a, um, she's, I won't say old because she's not old. She look really good, but I guess she's older because she say like, she didn't talk about like people my age, like older than me. So I don't know. I haven't heard her say her say, but she referenced like that she's older. Anyway, baby. She just like talk. It don't even be nothing extravagant. Like like her vlogs don't be like her just like doing a lot of stuff. She just talk. And baby, when I tell you, I'm intrigued. I'm so glad I found her channel. She would just like her voice, her mannerisms. She's very articulate. Um, yeah, y'all. I was like, oh my god. I I put Anthony's on her page too. And I was like, I like this lady. She just talk about anything, whatever going on. It could be um, Risa Tisa, anything. It could be something more um, like it, it, it's on a scale. Like she talk about everything. It could be something going on in the world, national news, or it could be something like on TikTok. I like her channel, y'all. Y'all check it out. I like, I'm so glad I found her. I've been binge watching her all day. I'm like, oh my God. And she's really um her thumbnails eats down baby they eat down i like a channel but anyway y'all the consensus was this that y'all like when i get in this bathroom and get in this robe and talk baby because when we in this robe we finna y'all know we finna handle business we finna talk when we in this robe 
child i don't um i just got off work y'all i've been um working of course i went i went and worked out this morning well i won't say worked out i walked um but i was on the phone the whole time with my friend girl and i couldn't record for y'all i should have like i want to record but i think i want to go walking again if i have time but anyway y'all i wanted to talk to y'all because we gotta come 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 here sit down sit down sit down it's, it's real we gotta dress our face but while we're doing that y'all remember this bag from um nordstrom we're gonna smell these we're gonna we're gonna smell them while we're talking we're gonna have a what should we call it a scent a scent test a scent a scent party i don't know Y'all trust me, right? If I say it's not good, y'all will buy it. I don't know. I ain't making no money off of this, so it ain't nothing like that. But, um, yeah, we'll do that while we talking. Y'all know that I had on the Tom Ford, um, Bitter Peach last night. Yeah, they definitely have influenced me to go ahead and purchase this. This one, I like this one. I'm gonna make sure I link this one in the video. This was really good. Like, and I know I was saying I didn't want to smell like a Girl Scout cookie, but baby, when I smelled like a peach... Girl, girl, girl. Okay, y'all know what it is when I got home, baby. Yeah. So, okay. So this one is Joe Malone. We love Joe Malone. Um, which what scent is this? It's a light floral. But what is the actual name? I don't see the name. I don't know. So the top is William Pear, the heart is Sweet Pea, the base is White Musk. So, ooh, that sounds, I like all those, so let's smell this. That smells good. I wish, why isn't the name on here? Oh, okay, it's English Pear and Sweet Pea. Joe Malone, English, where it's English Pear and Sweet Pea. That smells good, I don't. It doesn't smell better than the bitter peach. But anyway, let's let's start what we talk about. Okay, so y'all, I really, really try my best to make this a positive, safe space. And on my live, I don't know if you caught the live when I did my bob. When I did the old nasty bob, baby. I was trying to um like let y'all know how I really feel about the e-game. Like I really, I feel like we're family. Like y'all make me feel like Every now and then, here and there, it be some negative people. But for the most part, y'all are non-judgmental. Y'all made me feel like, I feel like y'all was dealt with me when Boo went to jail. Y'all was dealt with me when Boo got out of jail. Even the newcomers, they go back and they binge watch. Y'all just always so supportive. And I really feel like we cousins. Like we friends. Like that's my homegirl. Like when something happened, I be like, girl, I gotta tell, I gotta tell y'all. Like sometimes I be done told y'all stuff before I be done told my friend. I cut the camera and be like, I gotta tell y'all something. I gotta tell y'all something too, though. Maybe in the next vlog, maybe I do a members only live. It's something I haven't told y'all. I gotta tell y'all. But yeah, so I really try to be positive, be a safe space. I get on here and I be myself. I pride myself on being myself. I don't try to be like nobody. I don't talk about nobody. I don't like talk negative about nobody else's channel. I just don't do that. Like I don't do that. I shot people out as much as I can. I done shot people out so much that y'all done told me like, yo, chill, like dang. We, Cause y'all be trying to follow everybody I shot at and I really appreciate that for, for me and them. But yo, yesterday, yesterday and this morning, hold on y'all. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, y'all. Kids. So, um, what was I saying? Okay, so yesterday and this morning, there was people trying to come for me, y'all. So, never in Webster's Dictionary world did I ever, or uh, maybe it was um, misinterpreted that I'm saying that I came up with the word nasty. No. It's in Webster's Dictionary. It is a term that has been around forever um it is a term that a lot of times in the black community we use it as um in a good way like when i say nasty that mean it looks really good like i like it when i say nasty it ain't that it's nasty my nasty means i really really like it um but people came on my video and was like um some people was like oh somebody said first uh, somebody said i'm copying funky dineva um I don't, I don't, I don't, I, I like Funky Dineva. Um, so I'm not really, and I'm not, I'm not here to say that, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
I, Funky Dineva is not somebody that I watch all the time. I like Funky Dineva. Funky Dineva is very intellectual. He speaks very well, baby, and he reads down. Um, I, I don't remember. I think I have heard him say nasty, but my thing is this. I feel like y'all know how I be like, nasty! I don't hear nobody say it like me. Not that I came up with the nerd, the word nasty. Of course I did come up with the word nasty. And y'all is the ones that made me realize I say it so much. Y'all say that I say nasty, um, girl. And y'all say I always say it's cute. And when I start, like when I'm editing, I be seeing what y'all say. Because I always do. One time I was in the video, I was like, damn, girl, you done said it's cute 50 times. But I do. And y'all made me realize that. And y'all say y'all like when I say it. Now, so for me, maybe I could have said that differently. Um, Because I don't, I don't even know who is saying it. A couple people came in my inbox on Instagram and told me that people been stealing it. Like making like it that's theirs. But so maybe I said I maybe I could have said that differently. I don't know. So I apologize for that if anybody took that the wrong way. Um, but I just feel like I haven't seen and I don't watch everybody, so it could be somebody else out there that says it like me. Then another lady came on here from a fake page. Um, it was real suspect. Matter of fact, me and Nisi were together last night and um it was a fake page and I didn't even realize Nisi called it that the page had done been made 18 minutes ago and was like, I'm copying um this lady from Reaction Channel that I actually have supported, shot it out on this page, told y'all to go watch it, and I actually watch her content, comment, like, subscribe, all that. Um, so she was like that I'm copying her, and I'm just like, baby, um, like so at this point, I my rebuttal. I did copy her on something she said, which I said, let's check the car facts because that's something that she always says. Um, and I'm just like, I have no shade, but I've been on YouTube longer than her. Um, one thing about me, I've been like this. Anybody who know me for real, some people get on YouTube and they reinvent themselves. That's okay. This is who I am. Some, I'm not for everybody. I always talk. I don't change my voice. I always talk like this. I always been the loud, fun friend. That's just who I be. I always been that girl. I always had this heart. I always had a um a likable personality. I've always been told that all my life. People, all my life, people always told me I'm so down to earth. Like if a person didn't like me, I promise you it was out of pure jealousy. So I always been this way. So for somebody to say, and then it was like, oh, she say, oh, nasty. I don't even say, oh, nasty. Like my main thing, I be like, nasty. And it's just the way I say it. Um, so yeah, then and she was like, oh, you, um, and you even saying replay. Who the hell don't say replay? Go to people, like if somebody do a live and they people couldn't catch it, who the hell don't say replay? Replay. It's a million people say replay game. Woo, woo, woo. So that just kind of like, it kind of like rubbed me the wrong way, y'all. And I know I said that um I'm going to start letting people get to me. But especially when I'm in this positive space. And it was kind of, I told Nisa, I was like, I don't know. Because then one, a subscriber, the comment had only been up like maybe two or three minutes. And then a subscriber came right behind it and commented on it. And was like, then she changed her comment. And then, I don't know, it was weird. And I was like, Nisa, you think the two is associated? It was just weird. I don't know. But, um, I don't know, y'all. I didn't like that. And then, uh, then it was another fake page this morning. But, like, stand on what you say, baby. Don't hide behind the bushes. Because one thing about Ebony Elbow, I say what I got to say from my page, from my face, from my phone, from my camera, whatever. I say what I got to say from me. I don't hide behind no bushes or no fake pages. I'm going I'm to call a spade a spade. It was another fake page. And I paid attention to when the page was made and it had it was made today as well. And I'm like, y'all, of all people, I ain't no saint, but dang, come on now, y'all. Of all people, I really try to be positive. I try to support people. I want everybody to eat, everybody who want to do YouTube. I want them to eat off these check, these checks. I try to get in the comments as much as I can and um engage with y'all and let y'all know that I love y'all support. And you know, I just think I have a different way of saying it. I didn't create the word. It being in Webster's Dictionary. No, I didn't create the word. I just think I have a different way of saying it. A million people say nasty. I just have never heard nobody be like, nasty! 
that's just what I do. So I don't know. So for somebody to get on here, as much as I pride myself on, y'all know I talk about all the time, being who I am, for somebody to say that I'm trying to copy somebody or, girl, I'm copying somebody that I've been on YouTube, what, almost five years? Or is it five years? We can check the we can check the car fast. I think it's I think I'm five years in June for somebody that only been on YouTube, haven't been on YouTube five years. Okay, okay. Let's just go back to old videos because I've been this way. I don't talk any differently. I don't change my voice. I've been this way. I've evolved as anybody should. Like I've evolved. I've I've gotten better. Um, I've perfected my craft more. Um, but no, I don't like that. Don't don't ever tell me I'm copying somebody. I don't mind like one I like I came on here one time and this same um person who this person tried to say I'm copying. I told y'all the other it was a couple blogs back. I was like I heard a contract. I couldn't remember exactly who it was, but I didn't take credit for it. I was like and then somebody came to confidence and was like, Oh yeah, that's so and so said and I was like, Yep, yeah, it is. So um I was like putting she put ten on two, like saying somebody extra and I told y'all it is at that moment, like, I didn't make that up. Like, I didn't create that. I heard somebody else say it. I thought that was so cute. So, anytime I get something from somebody else, I'm sad. But, like, y'all, it's so easy to, like, like, so many of y'all be telling me, like, oh, I be saying nasty now. Like, if you watch me and it's something um that is intriguing that I say, or even if I watch somebody, like, unconsciously you might say it like not not that don't mean you copying them or like you know what i mean like i don't know it's just like it's intriguing to you it was kind of it was a little zesty and you was like okay girl that's cute so yeah i just had to address that like because say what you gotta say to me that's fine but um don't don't come on my page trying to disrespect me or don't um don't come make a like who the hell go out their way to make a fake like damn like it took me a little minute to set up my youtube channel like who the hell go out their way to make a fake page baby say what you gotta say to me from your page because i'm gonna say what i gotta say right in this camera but anyway y'all let's keep on going i just had to say that and um nisi she used to come to my storm she reminded me like hey we like Nisi like put me in coach like Nisi jumped in the comments like put me in coach like we ain't doing that like you ain't finna and like I told y'all the internet is undefeated so it's kind of pointless anyway so y'all know what I thought about I'm, I ain't gonna be able to keep spraying myself so I'm gonna start spraying the pamphlets what well, is not a pamphlet whatever they call this but this is Tory Burch um subline rolls I love anything rolls so let's smell this only thing I don't like about these y'all so, okay it's spraying that smell kind of good. It's like a strong, it's not like a florally. I kind of, no, I like everything because I like Baccarat. It's kind of strong. I like Baccarat. That smells good. Y'all smell it. What you think? Y'all like that? That smell good. I'm gonna, this, this might be a contender. I'm going to sit that to the side. We definitely get in a bitter peach. Toy, I mean, um, Tom Ford, bitter peach. Um... We got, I feel like Nordstrom did this on purpose. They know I'm weak. They know I have a, a, a spending problem. Y'all know I have a spending problem. And then it was like, let me send this to good old Ebony Elbow because her little dumb ass about all of it. <laughs> um, I like this one, y'all. This I got good girl, but I got the black and gold bottle. And I smelled this in Ulta a few weeks ago. And I was like, I like this one. So we might be ordering this one too. So this is the good girl blush. Let me smell it again. Yeah, that smells good. I like that. I like that. I like that. All the people saying they got me a birthday gift and I ain't never get it. You can get me this. <laughs> I like that. Don't y'all hate when people do that? They be like, I got your gift, girl. A whole year be done passed by. They be like, I got your gift. This smells good. I like that. So, yeah, we're going to sit that over there. What else we got? I think so. A lot of this stuff is facial stuff, too. Um, so this revolution, um, what else we got? Oh, this is, um, Charlotte Til Tilbury, um, the I Magic Rescue. I heard about that. I heard about that. What else we got in here, y'all? It's a lot of facial stuff. I have really sensitive skin, so I gotta be careful. Y'all remember how I bought that La Roche? can't use it y'all that thing told my skin up baby and when i wash my face i be trying to like wash here and wash y'all always get your neck too especially as um 
us African American women, like I don't know why us black women, you can always tell our age or our age range from our hands and our neck. You can always tell a black woman age, most people by their hands and their neck. So make sure like when y'all doing y'all facial routine or skincare, get your neck too, baby, and your hands. Y'all, I got I recently got this. I won it at a party, but I was gonna buy it if I didn't win it. It's called um satin hands, and I'm gonna start using it. It's by um Mary Kay. But I'm going to start using this because I use a lot of chemicals and I wash my dishes and bleach and I know I should be wearing gloves. I know. And I don't. And I feel like my hands are kind of like, they don't, they look, they don't look my age. They don't look like I'm 22. I'm only 22. They don't look like I'm 22. So yeah, I'm going to start using that set of hands from Mary Kay. But what else we got in here? I want to smell some more perfume. What is this, Mac? What is this? Serumizer, hmm, skin balance and hydrating serum. Okay, I don't know, I don't know about that. Lancome, what else we got? This is um, Yensa Tone Up Primer Essential Glow. I don't know if I want to glow, I'm already oily, but we'll try it because it was free. It was free, it was free. We'll try that, but yeah, um, I think this is me and your Javinci men. Let me see, I might order this for boo. I think I. I might have smelled this before. I don't know. Y'all know what's so crazy? Like, y'all boo being so mad at me. Oh, this smell good. Gr gr smell that. That smell good. Y'all like that? I might surprise him with that. Because y'all, guess what, child? I don't know. I don't even know why. Well, y'all know that I had, if you've been here for a while, y'all, I called myself, when I had moved, I called myself putting all my, like, I won't say all because I still got some designer stuff left, so let me not exaggerate, baby, because the people, they be... Anyway, um, I call myself putting a lot of my designer stuff in a black trash bag to move with me so that the um the men that was helping us didn't have to touch it. I wanted to move it with me, and I put it in a black trash bag. Baby, let me tell y'all something. Don't ever do that. Because y'all know what I did? I mistaken that black trash bag for trash and set it out to the trash. And y'all booting them even went and looked in the dumpster and everything. Where they end up taking the trash to a dumpster. So I had so much stuff. They didn't want to sit on my curb. They took it to... They was all in the dumpster, y'all. But somebody had done got it by the time I realized it. I'm talking about I lost two Louis Vuitton bags. I lost... Oh, God. I don't even want to think about it. Mm -mm. Next subject. Word to the wise, do not do that. That was the dumbest thing I could have did. And then when I I was talking about it on Facebook and like a few other people done told me, it was like, I did that too. Like it is so easy to mistake it, especially when you moving and you got so much stuff. Y'all don't do that. But anyway, y'all, let me, um, if y'all had any of those things that I just talked about, let me know what y'all think about it. But y'all not this. I did get this from Chelsea Janae. Okay, let's be clear. I got this from Chelsea Janae. I wanted to do this, so if you follow Chelsea Janae, I'll link her page below to y'all. She, um, and shout out to Chelsea Janae for giving me that, um, that shout out, y'all. It was so many of y'all telling me, like, Chelsea gave you a shout out. And I was like, she really didn't have to do that. It was so nice. Not only me, she had, um, it's court on there. She had, um. It was a few other people. And I thought that was so sweet of her because she had everybody write like their um YouTube name down in this book. She passed it around. And you could tell like when she not just saying like I, su I support, I watch. She really does watch me because she had me down to the T. Even when I got to the um to her event, y'all seen on the camera, she was like E-game. So that lets me know she really does watch. And I love that for us. But she was like giving people shout outs and she was like saying like what she like about their channel and you can tell she was really watching it ain't like she just went and watched one video baby knew the, baby knew the tea okay but she always i guess she do every year she do a piggy bank this is an indestructible piggy bank so in order to break it to get in it you got to break it in this I guess that's what ceramic you gotta break it with a hammer so you can't get the money out and she says she um cracks it on her birthday and whatever however much in there it's like you know her birthday like money she ball out with it so we finna do that and y'all when i went to y'all of course y'all know i got pink they had a lot of colors i think they had like at least seven or eight different colors on them but when i went to order mine first of all i ordered this sunday it came yesterday so it came overnight 
It was it was on sale, y'all. I think it was on sale for like $8.99. I could be wrong. It was no more than ten dollars. I made sure I link it below. But I'm challenging the e-game. I want everybody to click that link below and order you one of these piggy banks, y'all. It was no more than ten dollars. I'm not a person that carry cash, but I'm going to try to make a conscious effort to like whatever cash I get or pull some cash out sometimes and put it in this piggy bank. So with that being said, I remember that I had a little cash left over. And y'all, why the hell I spent $250 last night on some food? We ain't doing that no more. Not right now. Not, we too, not till we get in the house. $250 with the tip. It was too, my bill was like $193. And then I tipped the lady. She was real sweet. Like me and Nisa was just running our mouth and she was so patient. She was real sweet. She offered to um take our picture and everything. We still forgot to take a group picture. I mean, a picture together, Nisi. But anyway, so this is only, I'm only starting off with $18. This is all the cash I got on me. But we're going to put it in there and we're going to practice. I don't know if I want to do mine for my birthday or for Christmas. Because y'all know I like to be extra for my kids Christmas. So maybe I'll do it for my birthday. I don't know. But we're going to keep saying, or maybe, you know what, y'all? Maybe I'll do this for my um house. This to be my furniture money. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, girl. That's a good one, y'all. Oh, yeah, this is going to motivate me to put a lot in there. So, yeah, this will be for my furniture because any money that, is y'all know, if you ever bought a house, anybody that's going to want my house, it got to be in the bank, baby. It got to be accounted for. They want to know. They don't play, baby. Every dime got to be accounted for. They want to know where this transaction came from, that one. So, yeah, we're going to put this in here. And, yeah, child, I just wanted to address that. And, y'all, I really don't want to be addressing stuff on here because I don't want to be that girl. Like, I want us to continue. Like, I feel like we have fun over here and I want us to continue to have fun. I want it to continue to be a safe space. I want people to feel like they can talk, be open. And I want to feel like I can talk and be open because, like, y'all, sometimes, like, I don't I don't like all that. Like, I'm 37 now. I don't like all that drama and I don't I got mad because I know my heart. Like, Nisi had to calm me down. I got mad. Because, like, don't try me, especially on no punk-ass shit from no fake page. Like, I'ma just keep it G. Like, don't, don't do that. So, I got mad, but I don't, and I don't like to get in that space no more. Like, I like my peace. I mind my business. I don't talk about nobody. I support everybody that I can. Just don't bring that to my channel. And if you a subscriber that did that, just leave, baby. Don't watch me. Don't hide from no fake page. Just leave. I'd rather you not be here. Seriously. Just leave. If you feel any type of way about me or whatever, just leave. And what's wrong with anybody who, like, not necessarily do it exactly like somebody, but if somebody influenced you, just like Chelsea influenced me to get this bank, like, but I'm giving her credit, you know. Like, if you see something, if you say something, like, I love when y'all say nasty. I love when y'all say it. Y'all been tagging me on Instagram, and I love it, baby. I love it, okay? But anyway, like, that's the whole purpose of, I thought that was the whole purpose of being an influencer. Yeah, so anyway, but yeah, um, y'all, I feel like what we about to do now, I want to go back work out again, but I want y'all to know I still ain't put the boys comforter on, but they finna help me. They room is filthy, so they gonna help me get this room together. I'm not doing it by myself. Yeah, they gonna help me. Yeah, let's do that. So yeah, this is the filthy room. All this gotta go. Y'all realize straighten all these shoes up so good. Yeah. Y'all ready? Yeah, they mad. We've been tripping to the stars. We've been rather wrecking cars. At this point, I'm just throwing everything on me. I'm pissed. Everything is going in the trash. Whatever you with, I'm with it. How you gonna cross a nigga? I'm rocking with you. I got you lit in the city. I've been multitasking, rapping and being a daddy to my little children. I've been spending on business and spending and spending and spending and spending and spending. I'm dizzy. I do all the smack. He knows stuff will help with none of you killing. You doing a lot of cap and watch when I catch him awake in front of witness. Damn, I knew you were tripping. We could have been superstars. Remember when we were taking cars? Now it's not safe for you. You switch. 
just like a pussy little bitch. Damn, I knew you tripping. You could have been superstars. Yeah, but now I'm reminiscing. Remember when we were drinking cars? Now you better keep your distance, cause it's not safe. to get them like a really nice bedroom set like each one of them a nice one and that's gonna be the one that take me on the glory that's gonna be the last one they get so yeah that's all i'm gonna do so they been saying they normally they been wanting to like um sleep together but normally they been saying they want their own room so yeah i'm gonna get them their own room they getting old enough so ty cooking my daughter cooking dinner she cooking spaghetti so yeah Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, they had Poppy, the strawberry lemon at um, Ross, two packs. I got two of them. They don't never have a um, strawberry lemon. It's always like the raspberry, so y'all know I snagged it. Cheers. Ty, tell the people what you're cooking. Spaghetti. Do she look like me? Do. No. Do. Negative. <laughs> <laughs> All right, E gang. I just got oh they, they I was on live and it was like you're hella cute. Y'all I literally did flat iron it. I just took it out of the bonnet. Now that I'm looking, I'm like, okay, it is a little it still is a little nasty. Anyway, E gang, um, I'm about to go to bed. Um, watch my last live. We talked about YouTube. I know a lot of people be asking me about YouTube advice. Watch my y'all. Let me tell y'all this. A lot of the stuff y'all be asking me questions to is in my description. Y'all try to be very informative in my description. So the video where I talked about how to clean this uh, cleaning business is in my description. Mom, um, I found your videos. You found my videos. You did. Why are you not asleep? Child, they was home with my daughter. Cause if it was me, they would have been in bed. It's like eleven, I think. Um, well, Kim came on spring break. But um, how to start a cleaning business? What type of camera I use? My Amazon storefront. Um, like just different commonly asked questions. I have like a section down there. Um, just always check the description, y'all. Uh, a lot of the stuff y'all ask me is in the description box. I try to make it so accessible and easy for y'all. But anyway, y'all, I'm about to y'all. When we was on live, they was booze just talk about some show called um side chicks on Tubi. And a few of the people on the live knew about it, so I'm trying to decide whether I want to watch that or Love Is Blind. I don't know. But anyway, y'all, watch that video if you want to do YouTube. We talked about it a little bit. Just trying to keep. I'm trying to keep everybody encouraged. Like I was telling them, my numbers are low right now. My numbers are really low compared to what I was doing. Um, and I know also it's because I'm not doing the prison wife vlogs anymore. It's crazy how people love negativity. 
But, you know, that's just the world we live in. Like, I got way more views when my husband was in jail. But I'm okay. Like, I love the people who are here with me, who truly rock with me. And we're just going to keep going. So, yeah, E-Gang, I'm going to head out. Time to shower and watch one of these shows. So, y'all, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I truly, from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate all y'all. And I love y'all. And thank y'all for being here.